Maybe try the middle. Middle? Yes. <laughs> Would you want to get done today? Uh, really just like focus more so on uh, position work. Mm -hmm. Just because going through combine, I did the majority of all this, so. I was just most focused on drills. What response do you get coming out of the combine from the teams that you're heading into here? <coughs> um, just overall, all like good, good things pretty much. You know, you've been through this process for people like Kanai, Ariane, looks like they opened some eyes today. What was it like to see those guys kind of get their shot and take advantage of it? Um, I was just excited for him, especially for Ariane. I thought he should have gone to the combine. Um, he had an amazing season last year and just come out here and prove a lot of people just wrong about his talent is is awesome to see. Where are you training right now? Uh, I'm in San Ramon, California at Cal Springs. You yeah, staying through the draft? I'm um, staying there at the end of the month and then going back home to uh, Henderson just so I can do like team workouts in my high school. What kind of questions do scouts have for you? Um, pretty much are all just generic questions asking like where you're from, uh, background, um, learn about where your scheme was while I played here, um, positions you played, and just things along those lines. When you're doing the position step today, what are you trying to show off? Um, just consistency, really. Um, I did pretty similar drills at the uh, at the combine, so I just show them off again and just realize that no matter where I'm at, I'm going to be consistent and do my thing. How's this whole draft process been for you? Um, it's been new and it's kind of been fun. Um, even though it can be just a little stressful, you got to embrace it and just have fun with it just because you know this is a once-in-a-lifetime experience. Do you talk to some of the former Ducks about how it is or, or keys to making it through it all? Yeah, I um, talk to Jake Fisher a lot. I uh, work out with Kiko Alonzo right now. So just been talking to Kiko and then other NFL guys who I work out with. Do you follow him? Like, can you, do you have to pay attention to kind of the daily here? He's uh, going in this round, he's going in that round, he's going here. Do you block that out? Do you pay attention? How do you, do you get through all the noise? Uh, it's kind of easy because you realize – Everyone on Twitter who's mentioned it doesn't have a drop pick. <laughs> so what their opinion is really doesn't matter just because they're not a GM, they're not an owner or a coach, so it's their opinion. Are you flying blind right now, or do you have a good sense <coughs> of what might happen on draft day? Uh, I have, like, a little bit of sense of what might happen and just uh, based on where I'm going to be, like, visiting and stuff like that, I kind of understand some teams who are more interested. Is that the next step now, maybe some official visits to teams? Uh, I don't know if that's what they call it, but... Yeah, just go visit teams and then uh, just do workouts with other teams. Private workouts? Yeah.